comments on electric potential eq potential a surface over which the potential is constant is called eq potential advantage of the potential formulation if you know v we can easily found e as e equal to minus grade v electric field is the negative gradient of potential the reference point o choice of the reference point is arbitrary a reference point can be changed by adding a constant k to the potential we know the equation for potential as v of r equal to minus integral o to r e dot dl at that time we considered the reference point as o now let us change the reference to a new position o prime then potential v prime of r v dash of r equal to minus integral o prime to r e dot dl reference point ennu parayunnathu krithyamayittum arbitrary aanu o ennu parayunna reference point nammal choose cheyada samayathu potential equation namukku ariyam v equal to minus integral o to r e dot dl o ku pagaram o prime ennu parayunna mattoru reference point aanu nammal choose cheyunnengil we can write the equation like this v prime of r equal to minus integral o prime of r e dot dl so here uh, we have the equation o prime to r e dot dl that we can write like o prime to r o prime to r anadina namukku rendu term aayitu o prime to o plus o to r anna reethiyil split cheythu edukkan varu that's it. ee equation ile ee term namukku already ariya this is v of r so v prime of r equal to some constant k plus v of r that is the reference point can be changed from o to o prime by just adding a constant k so this is the equation v prime of r equal to k plus v of r v prime of r equal to k plus v of r ipra k nu parayna ee term aanu namukku ariyam it is minus integral o prime to o e dot dl or ee minus symbol nammal olivaakkaanengil we can write integral o to o prime e dot dl so that is k is the line integral of e from old reference point o to the new reference point o prime now let us consider the case of potential difference with the reference point o we have an equation for potential with the reference point o prime we have another equation so these two equations are connected by a constant k now we need to consider the case of potential difference so let us consider the equation potential difference means v prime of b minus v prime of a equal to we will get v of b minus v of a because here there is a constant v prime of b equal to v of b plus k v prime of a equal to v of a plus k so this k can be cancelled out so adding a constant will not affect the potential difference or first term lhs we can call it as grade v prime del v prime similarly rhs is del v so grade v prime equal to grade v potential obey superposition principle by superposition principle total force on a test charge q is the vector sum of individual forces this we already discussed f equal to f1 plus f2 plus etc now we can divide this f by q and we will get e divide throughout the equation by q we will get the electric field and we know that electric field to obey the superposition principle that is e equal to e1 plus e2 plus etc now from e we can reach to v by an integration that is v equal to minus integral o to r e dot dl integrating from o to r the potential also can be written as v equal to v1 plus v2 plus etc that is the potential at any given point is the sum of the potentials due to all the source charges separately potential at any given point is the sum of the potentials we have a important factor here v is a scalar quantity v is not a vector comparing to addition of vectors addition of scalar is easy there is another benefit of potential formulation unit of potential we know that uh, the force has a unit newton and charge has a unit of coulomb the potential has a unit newton meter per coulomb potential has a unit newton meter per coulomb or joules per coulomb 
और वॉल्ट 